Well guys, we're back at Hollywood Studios. It's been a couple weeks and as you can tell, spring break started. We weren't in any of the parks last week. There was technically a vlog, but I didn't post it because guess what? I got a new camera, but it doesn't work with my laptop. So back to the GoPro for now. But as you can see, spring break has definitely started. The crowds are here. So let's go see what we can do today. There's no plan. I'm gonna hang out. I'm gonna go on some rides and we're gonna have some food and then we're gonna go to Epcot. This store is not open. It was last time I was here. Maybe they open later. We'll go check later. First stop of the day today, guys, is gonna be Star Tours, cause why not? And it's a 40 minute wait. So let's go get in line and chill. We got nothing but time. Prior to leaving the spaceport, passengers requiring assistance should visit the nearest spaceport. This little guy's left in trouble. Oh. I see it's my break time. Excuse me for a moment while I shut down. Bye bye. All right, guys, we just got off Star Tours. That was like a 40 minute wait, not bad. Uh, and it was actually about 40 minutes. So now on to Batu. We're gonna go in and see how crowded it is. Like I said, it is spring break the last couple of weeks so far. It's been pretty busy in there. So let's go see how it is today. It's a Saturday, so I imagine it's gonna be very, very busy. But I'm excited to be back nonetheless. So let's go in and have a great time on another planet. So far guys, it is not too terrible over here. I'd expect over by the marketplace and stuff, it's gonna be probably a lot more crowded, but you can still get your photos with the ships, the spaceships, the A-wing and the X-wing. And uh, yeah, it looks like over there is gonna be a little more crowded, so. Let's fast forward. Well guys, now that we're getting a little farther in here, it's getting a little more crowded. There are big lines at Joy Depot and Sabi's Workshop, and I'd imagine you need a reservation to get into any of those right now anyways. Um, but there's Chewy. Hi Chewy. Hi Chewbacca. He is paying attention to other people. Keep in watch. Chewie's doing a great job. And see guys, all the way down here, almost at the end of the stairs, is the end of the line for Doc Ondar's Den of Antiquities. But we're not going to go there. We're going to head to Docking Bay 7 at Mobile Order, that new Spork. Um, I just ran into Kyle Paolo, who is one of my new favorite vloggers, and they have the Sporks back, and he showed me, and it's awesome, so I'm going to get one. So let's go. But yeah, check out this line. Big lines everywhere all over it's a busy weekend and you gotta love the falcon every time listen to her wind up well something busted that's okay hondo's men are on it and working on it that's okay so guys we just ordered our spork through mobile order but i have to wait till 11 35 to place it because that was the first available thing so we're gonna wait in the shade over here until 11.35, and then we'll go and get our sport. Shade, here we come. Look guys, Ray was out. Oh, bye Ray. I just missed her, oh well. There are some stormtroopers out. No Kylo, but stormtroopers, they're okay. Also guys, we did get our sport and it's awesome uh, i'll take some pictures and put them on my instagram so go check that out instagram same as here is brian's magic life it's linked on my profile so just go check that out i really want to see kyle guys just to get into the droid shop to look at merch there's an even other line on the other side and then the line for smugglers run goes all the way back towards toy story land right now let's go check out this Tyaclon up here on the other side of these walls. See if any stormtroopers or Kylo or anyone is out. This pathway isn't too bad like the rest of them have been. This one's not very overcrowded at all, but I'm not a lion, so let me get away from that line. It's very noisy with all the ambiance sound. But isn't it just always amazing to be on Batu? I think I need to go find that Star Tour ship and see if they can take me to another planet because uh, this planet looks a little crowded today. Maybe we'll go see if there's a toy planet I can check out. Oh, 
That ship sounds like it just landed, but everyone knows it never goes anywhere. But let's head back this way and get out of this people's picture and uh, go check out Toy Story Land. All right, guys, like I said, to Toy Story Land we go. I'm just waiting for it to be one o'clock so I can try to get a boarding group at one o'clock because I didn't get up early enough to try this morning, which is okay. I needed to sleep. I've had a long week, but uh, so until one, let's go into Toy Story Land and see what the wait times are like. Maybe I can get on a ride before one. I think it's like 1130 ish right now. So, okay. It's like 1145, whatever. So we've got like an hour and a half. Here we go. All right guys, so Alien Swilling Saucers is at a 40 minute wait. This place is buzzing. Anyone? Bueller? Anyone? Um, let's go see what the other lines are like. Uh, when I checked on the app, Slinky I think was 65 or 70, and Twister Mania was I think 40, 45. So let's go see if that's still the case. There goes Slinky. Ooh, very crowded area here guys. This almost feels like pre-COVID right here. Everyone just walked in arm to arm. <laughs> Um, yeah, let's get out of this area. Um, there. Of course, we're up this way. Well, guys, check out this huge footprint. I've noticed this ever since I've been here before, but a lot of people don't notice Andy's footprints. How awesome. And Toy Story Mania is a 40 minute wait, so let's go hop in line, because that'll kill some time until one o'clock. But, Slinky is even farther back over here. So yeah, I think it's about 65, 70 from what the wait time said. Um, but it goes pretty far back. Let's go see how far back Toy Story goes because we're still walking back all the way this way. And yes, guys, we're still walking. We still haven't gotten to the back yet. It's going pretty far back. I'll let you know when we get there. We still haven't arrived, but the end of the line is here where Munisaburg used to be. Oh, it's still technically Munisaburg, but there's just nothing out here. So let's go hop on in line. It says 40 minutes still. So this should be fun. It's just a good way to stay socially distant though. Not that I see a lot of social distancing right there. We were right. We're about halfway back up to the front here, guys. Um, and I am timing it, so I'll let you see the timer when we get there. But I just love the views. It's great in here, guys. As you can tell, you can hear the announcement. Keep your mask on, you know, all that stuff. We're relatively used to that. Now. And we've made it inside now, so we're making good progress. Ah, air conditioning. I just really love this queue, guys. It's so awesome. We're almost there. All right guys, we'll stop it now because we're right here at hand. 28 minutes, not 40. All right, good timing. I love it. This is moment of truth, how did we do? 190,000. I have not gotten a club. I haven't gotten to 200,000 in forever. I'm still not there, guys. Oh well, next time, next time. But I did manage to get best in vehicle, so good stuff. Good job, Brian, good job. All right guys, we had a successful round. It was 190,800. Not my best, but onward and forward. So many people coming off at the same time, all around us, all around us. Uh, it's about 12.20 now, so we're just gonna wait till one and see if we can get a boarding group. So let's go find a good spot to hang out. You know, I said we needed to find a nice shady place to just hang out for the next 40-ish minutes. I'm realizing there's really not a lot of shade in this park, um, but I have an, specific place in mind that I found some shade last time I waited for a one o'clock boarding group. So let's go this way. And if it's free, I'll show you my favorite spot to just kind of hang out and enjoy a little bit of shade. Well guys, we found a nice shady spot on a bench here and I got Gertie behind me. And then right across from me, I'm tempted to get a slushy or icy. So let's see, but this is a nice place to chill for the next, it looks like half hour now, so myself a good view of Gertie, good old Gertie. You can usually get ice cream there. When I walked by earlier, it did not look like she was open. She is kind of a seasonal kind of place and I'm not sure they've had her staffed since they reopened. I'm not sure. I, I, I haven't seen her open since, um, since before. I think maybe I've seen her open once and that was during the holidays. So maybe since it's spring break and summer is coming up, she'll be open more. 
Um, I'll walk by there later and see if she's open now that it's later in the day. But um, we'll walk over there when we go back toward Batu. All right, guys, once again, we were successful with the one o'clock boarding groups. We got group 138. So I'm gonna go ahead to the Riviera Resort and get some lunch because I love the food over at the Riviera Resort. So let's get on Skyliner, shall we? We're on the gondola. We've got a nice clear one with nothing on it. So we get a great view of the parking lot and just everything. And take off. Whee! <laughs> this is my favorite part. I love this thing. I really hope that they will expand the Skyliner some more to other parks from other resorts and stuff because it is a great mode of transportation. Alright guys, so we're on our way to the Riviera Resort. We're going to get some lunch at Primo Piazzo because I love it there. Such good food and just such a great place to just hang out while we wait for our boarding group. Um, other studios is a little busy and all I want to do is Rise of the Resistance. So we'll go get some lunch. Maybe by the end of lunch they'll be on our group. Who knows? If not, you know, we'll chill for a little bit before we come back. Then we'll ride the Skyliner back and go on rides. But look, hey, remember when this used to be completely full and that was 100% capacity? Not anymore. Someday, I'm sure it'll be back to that. But for now, let's enjoy the little walks. All right, we've transferred onto the gondola that's gonna take us to the Riviera Resort. And I just love the views of the Caribbean Beach Resort and the lake here so when we get a better view of that I'm going to show you you'll see it's beautiful there you go what did I tell you beautiful look at the views of that lake lagoon whatever you want to call it it's great and look the little island in the middle super awesome I have already ordered my food um as soon as I get to the station down there I'm going to go ahead and hit that I'm here to prepare food option um the window I had for, was from like now to like, you know, a half hour or so from now. So I figured go ahead and do it. <sighs> and look, you can see Disney Springs off in the distance. I'll zoom in. There you go. There's what used to be characters in flight. I think they just, I don't know what they call it anymore, but I don't think they call it characters in flight anymore. But that's what that used to be. And there's the, per, the uh, Grand Riviera Resort. I almost called it Primo Piatto. But the Primo Piatto is you know, down all the way on the bottom there, uh, in the corner, right over in there. So we'll be there soon. So hungry, let's go eat. All right guys, we have made it to the Riviera. I've already hit the, I'm here, prepare my food option. So I got the hot, no, spicy Italian sandwich, which should be really good. Not to be confused with the hot Italian sandwich that they do over at the Grand Floridian. This is supposed to be spicy. So I can't wait to try it. I love spicy Italian food. And look, it's Sven from Frozen. All right, let's go get some food, guys. All right, guys, we've had enough of a break. It's time to head back to the Skyliner and head back to Hollywood Studios because we're only about 30 away from our boarding group now. So, you know, probably about an hour and a half or two here. So why not start heading back now? We'll take it slowly, leisurely strolls, but it is busy here. Let me tell you, those pools are crowded, even the adult only ones. So yeah, definitely spring break. All right guys, we're back and it is still super busy. Oh, there seems to be some people headed toward the exit, possibly to do some park hopping because it is just a little after two o'clock. And as you know, after two o'clock you can park hop as long as the park is not at capacity. So I wonder if anyone's park hopping. Let's head towards Batu. Guys, check out this Sprite droid cart. Just coming through the land. Don't mind him. Just bringing some more thermal detonators. Good stuff. Check it out. We're here. We're here, guys. We're here. I'm gonna bring you along with me because we haven't been on together in a while. Yes, General. Enemies of the First Order, 
We will soon snuff out your meager resistance business. You have what I want. You know the location of the secret base, and I will take it from you. Securely fastened. Keep hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the transport and supervise your children. I love this. What the? Tell them it's a Krishna transfer. <laughs> Alright guys, that's gonna do it for us here from Hollywood Studios today. Thank you so much for joining me as always. It was super fun. I know we didn't do too much. Just took a chill day and relaxed. But next week, Epcot for more festival, um, Flower Garden Festival. Almost a festival of the arts, but that's over. So go ahead, like the video for me guys. Give it a big thumbs up. It really does a lot of good for the channel. And like, comment, subscribe, share, all of the above. I will see you guys next week for a fun, fun time at Flower and Garden.